Welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Ambitions. We are now on part 18. Um, we're going to have Bill Compton go out and do a job. He's uh, stir crazy, so it's good if he gets out of the house a little bit. Uh, let's see. That really jerky neighbor. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're going to renovate your house, all right. Yes, we are. I am very excited for this, actually. We're gonna go back, and uh, I know we already blew up his bed, but uh, there's just a little insy. There's just a little part of me that's still a little upset. You know, he's the first one that gave us a bad review. Um, where is he running off to? You're going to the wrong house. Let's see. Ah, uh, here we are. So. I'd say we're gonna give his whole house an entire makeover. He is gonna love this house, I can tell you right now. He's gonna just go insane. He's gonna love this. He is gonna really, really love this. In fact, he's gonna just jump for joy when he sees what I've done. I just cannot wait to see what his reaction is going to be. Well, I think that's pretty good, wouldn't you agree? <laughs> Overall, I think you did an awesome job. Some of the floors and walls just work so well together. I really love you. Please come and visit my house when you can. Bye. Bill earned 280 simoleons. And he did a wonderful job. So now we're going to go home. Oh, and look at that. Luigi actually has some work to do as a ghost hunter. So let's go do that. This is the first time I see Luigi on the motorcycle, I think. It's kind of funny. Uh, let's see, is it a household that we know? Oh, look at this, the trash can's possessed. Oh, <laughs> it would be this guy. It's a um, pink-haired mohawk, blood-splattered, headphone-wearing man. <laughs> And it looks like ghosts have been um, haunting him, so we're going to help him out. He looks like he's concerned. Don't worry, dude. I got this under control. You can go do what you're going to do. Got to take care of this fridge. All right, we got one more object. It looks like it's this bookcase over here. It's no big deal. We got this. We got this. That is pretty sweet. Nice work. I thought I'd never get any peace. Thank you so much. You are welcome, good sir. I forgot Luigi had that medal in his trophy. So let's see. They're all kind of cheap. Um, what I mean is they're all pretty... Uh, they're, they're not worth that much money. So let's actually release a ghost. We're going to get rid of this kind, young spirit, just to see how what it does. Oh! That's all. The spirit Luigi released can finally rest. Uh, I guess we have time for one more. Let's go over here. More paranormal activity. Oh, it's a community investigation. Is it in the cafe? Something dead has gone horribly wrong inside. Rush inside to set things straight. Oh, you just tripped a little bit before you went inside. <laughs> Alright, well, um, I guess we just wait for him to come back out. Let's go see what's going on in the household. Kate is playing baseball with... <laughs> with D-Bag. Uh, D-Bag is not too confident. He got scared by the ball that Kate was throwing at him like that and got hit in the face. 
Um, I think their baby is going to be pretty tough. <laughs> now, what is Yumi Bunny doing? Um, oh, I took a case and I didn't even realize it. What is it about? Let's see. Talk to Oliver to complete this opportunity. Um, why is it that people are always losing their wallets? I cannot imagine a more important piece of leather. Let's see what this guy has to say about his wallet. I asked Oliver to mentally retrace any footsteps taken over the last few hours. It appears that Oliver uh, made a brief spot stop at the beach. Alright, so we gotta go to the beach. The sand. Uh, this reminds me of when Bella went missing. <laughs> That's a cool reference. Um, I need to keep looking. Very well. Uh, I managed to recover Oliver's driver's license, but no other sign of meteor prize. The wallet. I should question some locals to see if they've seen the wallet. So we have to just question three sims. Is there any here in the beach? Can we question the shark? <laughs> nope, we cannot. Um, well, let's go to... Holy crap! That's a big cloud. What's with that? Um, we're gonna go over here to the park again. Luigi's not doing too well, but he's almost done. After that, he's gonna go home. Um, the ghost has been banished, the chefs are safe, and with all no interruption with the food or customers. So, Luigi did a good job. Now I can go home and eat, shower, and go to sleep. As for Yumi Bunny, um, oh, it looks like she's tired too. Or no, she's hungry, so she's gonna go home. Gonna go home. <laughs> and our neighbor's still blown up to pieces and hasn't showered in forever. Cause that's what he gets. Uh, let's see, how's D-Bag doing? Him and Kay are both asleep. Uh, they're both in relatively good moods, sort of. He is a little tired, but um, I want him to... What the hell is going on with this? Oh, wait! The baby's coming! Who cares? Oh god, baby's coming. Take her to the hospital. Take her to the hospital. Come on. Chop, chop. Hurry up. Run. Or wait. No, don't go to the hospital. Come back. Come back. Just kidding. Abort mission. God, go into the house. Okay, we are going to have a home birth. Um, you know what? This is actually going to be the nursery. And this is where they're going to give birth. So uh, everyone should wake up and... No! Don't go to the computer. Go to your see your wife give birth, you jerk. Nope, we're not gonna take it to the hospital. We're gonna have her have a home birth. Bill is freaking out. Stop trying to play the computer, D-Bag. You have to be here to see this. If you don't, you'll regret it. Yumi Bunny is just so tired. Bill does not want to see this at all. But come on. Let's see. Any day now, Kate. Oh, it's a new baby girl. Cool. Kate and D-Bag have given birth to a baby girl, and we are going to name her Shirley. Um, she's good, and uh, let's see, let's do random. Artistic, she's good and artistic. We don't have a crib for her! <laughs> good thing we have some like, where are you going? Come back over here! Um, there's a baby girl, little Shirley. And this is her room. Good thing it's already pink, because if not, I'd be a little mad. Um, Yumi Bunny, go over here. Because this is going to be the new... Oh, don't just put the baby on the floor and walk away. What's wrong with you? <laughs> well, I guess you have to go use the toilet. And damn it, Paris! D-Bag just had a baby. You're a little bitch. Ah. <sighs> When we come back, we're gonna build or buy stuff for the baby, the nursery and stuff. So I'll see you guys then. Bye for now.